A Clearwater County judge has dismissed all charges against a group of protesters who were facing trial for reportedly causing damage to a pipeline. Reporter Sherelle Moore is live tonight with more on the case. Sherelle? Thank you, Dennis. The defense team says they were shocked by the judge's decision today. The original plan was to plead a necessity defense, which states you committed a crime for the greater good. Back in 2016, self-proclaimed Volve Turners, Emily Johnson and Annette Clampstein reportedly used bolt cutters to gain access to an Enbridge pipeline valve near Leonard with the goal of shutting down the pipeline. Support person Benjamin Jolders Jordersma was also on trial. The prosecution pleaded in this case. The defense then mentioned judgment acquittal. We think it's really important to bring this story before the jury, uh, you know, with uh, expert witnesses talking about why the, our situation is so dire right now that it's important that actually people start getting in the way of business as usual. And so whether that means shutting off a pipeline, whether it means people blockading an oil train. We were all fully prepared to explain why we did what we did and, you know, all the safety precautions we took and to make sure that, you know, no one would be harmed in this county. Um, we were sorry that we were unable to tell the local folks about that. Enbridge did give us a statement about the trial calling the defendant's actions reckless and dangerous and saying they will seek to prosecute those involved to the fullest extent of the law. We have their full statement online with this story. Dennis, back to you. All right, thank you, Sherelle, for that live report from our studio tonight. The prosecuting attorney on the case declined a request for comment. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.